Alrighty, today we're doing some fishing at La Jolla Shores. I am here with Luke. We are gonna be going out for anything. The surf is a little big. We got some fun rollers coming through, even though it looks kind of flat on GoPro. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and get out there and get rocking in and rolling. All right, so first thing you wanna do is walk it out to deep enough water to where your outboard can rest. For the beginning, I like to stand right at the front, make sure the boat is staying straight and just lifting it right up and over these breakers here. Now you probably can't tell, but I'm all the way up at my knees. All right, this is about the time I drop down the outboard. I like to keep everything straight facing towards the waves. When the wave comes, I push down on the boat. All right, so I'll let the motor warm up for a little bit. Now that it's started, just keep doing the same thing. You're gonna stand in the back of the boat, hold on to the handles you have here. Just push down as the boat at the front will lift up over the waves. Notice how nothing inside is wet. We're just continue out here, just like so. And so this is really all about timing. Don't rush it. If you don't feel comfortable, do not launch. Don't get in the boat yet. Um, I am waiting a little bit to see when I have an opening. This looks like a good time. I'm gonna walk it out a little deeper. All right, Luke, if you wanna hop on in. Might get a little wet. It's gonna walk it out just past this little lump. Now is a good time for me to hop on in. All right, don't jet it crazy fast because you're gonna like launch off these little waves here. Just nice and slow. We got some fun more rollers coming in. Look at this fun. It's nice and slow. All right, from now we can go full blast. There's some swimmers off to my right. I'm gonna go ahead and catch up with some of these scout owners way yonder. It's plopping around. <laughs> Smile, you gotta look natural. <laughs> Rockfish. Woo! Biggin'. Oh, woo, biter, good one. Oh, PB right here, PB, PB, oh. you're on? Got one. Biter, great, they're coming over. Oh, this thing's massive. Oh my, this thing is massive. 
dang it. Oh! There you go. Good one! Nice. PB right here. Double is here. Show me yours. Chunker. Video. Chunker. What's good? Loops on again. Smaller. 40 pound head. Oh, sandbag. <laughs> this bait? Is this for bait? <laughs> I caught me a white fish. Let's see what Luke has. A <laughs> pee pee rock fish. I knew it. Cheers. Cheers. And right now we're fishing at 140 feet. I just got a squid strip on the bottom. Just bouncing it. There we go. <laughs> Little guy. <laughs> Ab first ever. See ya. Bye, bud. Catching monsters. There you go. What is that? So we have had an eventful day. We're headed back into the launch. The red tide has kind of kicked in, so everything's really brown and murky. Uh, surf launch, fairly simple and easy to do. It's not too big, it's probably about two feet at its biggest. What you're gonna wanna do, you're gonna watch the waves. After the last set wave, you're gonna ride right behind it. Don't catch it, just right behind it. And then make sure your outboard is at the setting where once it hits the ground, it'll automatically lift itself up. Other than that, uh, pull the kill cord out, make sure your motor's not sucking up any sand, and then we're gonna head right in. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get going. Right now we are waiting. Here's a fun wave that is going to crash. Uh, we are gonna wait right behind it. Those kayakers are done for. That's a fun one. Go right behind this little one that's breaking too. all good and there we go we made it back safely 